Now that I know how to use autofill, I can use it to generate all sorts of things. So we saw how we could create a series. And here I've got a little series that I've just typed up of the drinks that Coffee Island sells. I can highlight all of it, click the drop, the little plus at the bottom right hand corner and copy it all the way down. I can just keep going. And as you can see, it's just replicating my list again and again. Well, that's great but I don't really want to have to type it on here each time I want to create that list. So I'm just gonna clear that. So what I want to do is create my own custom list. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to go to the file menu and come down to options. And here we're going to go to the advanced group where I'll scroll through until I come to the button that is edit custom lists. It's quite a way down and you can miss it the first time you try and look for it. So I'm going to click create custom lists and it pops up this box. On the right here is where I add my list entries for the list here that's called new list. Now I could, um, I could type them in or I can import them from the cells. Well, as I've already typed them, that's what I'm going to do. So I'm just going to select those cells there. And I'm now going to click import. And as you can see, it's just created a new list. So I could do it that way. If I want to add another list, I will go to new list. And I could have, I don't know, sun, moon, stars, and um, galaxy and that will also create a list I'll add it and there it is so I've now got two new lists both of them sitting in my custom list box so I'll click OK I'll click OK again and I'll come over here and I'll start to type capu Ooh, I need to spell it properly um, cappuccino and now I can click on there get my little drop down arrow and copy it across and as you can see it's working I can start from Americano remember before we could start from any month and I can go and I can do this horizontal or vertical I've got my Sun Moon and Stars equally I can use that to generate my list. So creating your own custom list is a great time saver if you find you're always typing the same headings um, in your spreadsheets. You may, you may have your department, sales, admin, training. You may have cost centers, electricity, gas, travel. Any, anything that you find that you type on a regular basis as a list, you can create your own custom list to save yourself oodles of time.